Hey, hey gang, Miss Hairbrush here. I'm so glad you've joined me today. We're going to draw a pumpkin together, and if you want to put a face on it at the end, you can turn it into a jack-o'-lantern. Printable coloring sheets of this drawing are available on my website, MissHairbrush.com. You can send me pictures of your drawings, and my coloring book and some free coloring sheets are on there too. First is to draw a circle the size you want your pumpkin to be. You can do this with a regular pencil. See how I go around and around lots of times? This is an easier way to draw a circle than trying to get it perfect the first time. Draw a little circle where you want the stem to be. Pumpkins are not smooth all over. They have ridges in their skin, so make loops like this all around. We are going to erase the lines we don't need, so don't worry about making mistakes on your drawing. Now, just draw around each of the loops at the bottom. Remember, you can always push pause anytime, and you can erase and redraw as many times as you want until you feel good about your drawing. I had to do this several times before I got it just right. Now let's put on the stem. It looks good gang, time to color. Get out your bowl of water if you're using watercolors. Take out a light green and a dark green, a yellow, an orange, and a light brown, and a gray or black. We will start with the yellow. This is going to look weird at the beginning, like a lot of my drawings, but don't worry, it will all work together in the end. Color the middle of your pumpkin in the yellow. Okay, good. Now for the orange. We are going to color all the white spots we have left and trace over the loops you made. A pumpkin is a type of squash which grows on a vine and it is a fruit. They come in many different shapes and colors and sizes. Pumpkins are native to Central and North America and the people living there have been eating them for thousands of years, just like we do today. In America, we love pumpkins. We decorate our houses with them, make them into pies, and even put them in our coffee. Okay, we finished up the orange, so now go in and blend the orange and yellow together on each loop, just like this. These two look good. See how it's starting to look like a real pumpkin? Did you know there are giant pumpkins? People try to grow the biggest pumpkins they can and have contests to see whose is the biggest. At my house, we all go to the county fair each year and try to guess the weight of the biggest pumpkin. Here's a picture of the winner at 1,224 pounds. Mr. Golf Club's hands are in this picture because his guess won that year, whatever. The biggest pumpkin ever recorded was 2,323 pounds, twice the size of this one. Wow.
make sure your loops are nice and dark so you can really see them. Let's do this stem. Color switch up to light green and color it all in. With your dark green, make little lines like this that show the direction the stem grew. Add a bit of shading. Last color is the brown. It's all about building colors on top of colors. Do the same thing you did with the orange around each loop. Don't cover up all the orange, just a little bit around the edges with the brown. And finally, with your gray or your black dipped in water, add some shading to the stem and the pumpkin. Coloring is done, so get out your black pen to finish it all up. Outline lightly around the whole thing like this. draw these pumpkins on Halloween or make Thanksgiving cards or decorations for the round the house. If you're just doing a pumpkin, you're all done. But if you're doing a jack-o-lantern, he's gonna need a face. I've got lots of faces you can copy on MissHairbrush.com. I'm going to do a happy face here and show a scary face in the song. <laughs> I sketched the face in pencil quickly, outlined with my pen, and then I'll fill it all in with black. We love to carve pumpkins every year. It's gross, messy, and fun. This bad boy is all done. I hope you like your pumpkin drawings. 
I'm a Jacqueline, sitting on the front porch, watching trick or treaters coming through the front door. Looking up to mischief, flicker in my eyes. Here's my little secret, there's a candle inside. It used to be a pumpkin, growing on the vine. I'm the center of attention since I went under the knife. Chilling with the other gourds, talking about our plans. We're all missing some teeth, but we're gonna start a band. We'll call ourselves the Squashers, we'll tour down the coast. I'll learn to play piano. Wait, the scrolls are getting kind of close. It, it, seriously, is somebody gonna do something about the squirrels? Wait a minute. Where's Gordon? Gordon is gone. Happy Halloween! <laughs>